I'm just like the door carts away from it being finished, but look at this fucking brand new seat. It's like fabric fucking factory style fabric. Estela La Shiva. Hello, Estela. Who are you, baby? Estela La Shiva. Hello, Estela. Who are you, baby? Man, fuck rain. Seeing my cars get wet is like watching my children drown. Like, my rat needs no exposure to all this bullshit. <laughs> they look sexy wet, though. I'll give them that. I've been really fucking busy, I haven't been able to play with this shit for a while, the light broke. Put some fucking air on this bitch. My niece is crazy. Safety first, kids. Now nah, it got too rainy. She she couldn't see anymore without the goggles. She'd be booking it though. That shit goes like 50. It's cool for a little girl. Fatima, she's a dog just like you are. Leave her alone. Yo, fucking duck straight up would love watermelon. Like, this was our hyped on watermelon. The turkeys like it too, but fucking ducks, yo. Look at that food. Who's hyped? His name's Darwin. So I guess um, I must have been high when I made this throttle. Nah, well I had made this shit and I got stuck on full throttle. It was a fucking runoff bike for a bit there. A while back and then I just parked it. It's my nephew. It's too powerful for him. He's too small. Like that should do a wheelie and if you fuck with it. <laughs> It's a 212, but uh, yeah, I'm about to fix this bitch. You should look this pretty 212. You got a drill on top. You can't use the hole for the spring that was already there. And then you just drill on top. You got to give it a little kink here and a bend in the 90. And then, boom. Let's re uh, return throttle. Now I got to fuck with this because it broke. It's the whole cost of everything. So, but we're halfway there. It's pretty cool. So I decided to go with this fucking brake style from a bike. They work real good. You can have throttle. And it's like less of a chance of it getting stuck than the, the roller one. And it's firm. I want it to be firm because it's fast and I don't want my nephew to go trigger happy on that shit. I'm just gonna put it back together, see how it rolls. She's like a little puppy. She wants me to pet her. The fucking hood, yo!
shout out to LKQ for sending me the wrong spindle, motherfuckers. Damn you, I love how this bitch looks. I'm like, fuck. The interior looks fucking wicked with his door carts already on it. Straight off. Just complete it. New carpet. Everything. Brand new door handles. Some fucking brand new tires for the square. The front has new rear 50 series fat ass ones, but the front was lacking. This thing definitely is not burning oil, but uh, somebody had put silicone on this plug because you're supposed to replace these like every so often because they have a new little gasket, but they had put silicone, but it, it wasn't like leaking, leaking, but you could see a seep of oil and you can see like a tiny little, maybe like a droplet, but let's see if I can put some Teflon, tighten it real good, but I'm going to buy a new one. You want some of this? You want some of this corn, bitch? Nah. This is her mom's trip, and she's like, Where's my daughter at? <laughs> Toma. Yo, fucking O'Reilly came through <laughs> with a pull cart for the dirt bike. Little fucking mini bike. Mm, fuck it, just jam this shit in there real quick. Oh. There you go. Some fool on the Facebook, on the YouTube said that my bike looks like it has herpes. <laughs> it's a fucking foligator. I don't give a fuck, to be honest. That shit was like fucking 39.99. I need a fucking solo seat because it's just the way to be.
so I have to pull the fucking pull cover on this shit because I ripped the string. And these engines have been sitting around for a while, I guess. Like a year, maybe. So it's no surprise. The weather here takes a toll and everything. I got a new pull cord at O'Reilly, so it should be golden. This is a pretty cool cord. The top shows chrome, and this is the actual holder for the rope, so I gotta set it up real quick. You gotta twist it back and tension it here. If you let it go, it'll just spin a bunch of times. You gotta tension it and line up the holes, and then just run the wire through it. I already did that right here. I'm just gotta run the new cable through it. And right now I'm holding it like this, but if I was to let go, it'll just fucking spin. Just back it up all the way till it's like really fucking tense. Gravity is a motherfucker. I'm gonna take some gas out of my rig because I need it for the dirt bikes. I'm too lazy to go to the store. I don't even need gas sitting in my tank for uh, hardly ever use this shit anyway. Lemus! Lemus! Come here! So I put three of these three quarter liter fucking cups. Since this engine's not from here, that tank is not even really a tank. It's just like this full shell. So this is the easiest, most cleanest way to do it. With this funnel. But yeah, it should be like almost full tank. Gotta put some on the small red one too. Put fucking shocks in the square. Dang it! Look at them fucking wheels though. Brand new tires. I put a fucking 516 spacer because these are the 5x7s and I like the flat look for the big and littles, but I want it to come out just to be flush like the back. But it looks and looks sick. The back has 50 series. Uh, they're like 15 by 8 with a fat ass wheel. <laughs> Have to fucking hand winch this motherfucker forward. You are cabrones! Hey! Hello, guys, it's on me. Stella! 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 Pavon! Aunque esté la pavón. Parece una calavera. Tiene las manchillas negras nomás, mira. Lemus. No fighting with the goat. Lemus. Gotta degrease this hole. The valve cover gas could leak like a motherfucker. And it's because of these stupid ass fucking chrome stick shits that are, you can't even tighten, you have to use fucking 
vice grips and shit. I don't know if they came with a special tool when they bought them, but they're all like hand tight. And they're all like scarred already where they use vice grips to tighten them, but fuck that. I'm gonna put some hardware and like some split, like some splitter plates so I don't have this fucking problem anymore. I don't really care much for those little fucking chrome shits, you know? But yeah, I'm gonna fucking get it all degreased. I had already cleaned the degrees of block, all that shit, and then, you know, <clears throat> sand and everything, but it's just really loose layer and shit. I think it has been cleaner and painted. This shit's beautiful. But yeah. I've been waiting on this goddamn spindle forever, and UPS just brought it. But uh, I wanted to make a note on how this sensor wasn't connected. And well, they always cut them in the junkyard. So it's gonna stay unconnected, I guess. Alright, so this is not right. None of the fucking bolts have the fucking cutter pin, and this one's straight broken the fuck off. So um, it's unsafe to be even having it like that because the nut's gonna back itself out. In my opinion, it needs to be that fucking tie rod and needs to be replaced for one that's not broken, but whatever, you know. I'm gonna tell the owner. I have this hole pretty much ready, bolted up. That's the old one. That's the new one. Um, the problem I'm having is that these cats were all missing the bolts, obviously, because they had fucked up the other bracket. And um, now I'm missing one of these bolts. I found one because the other one that I had was stripped, and I found this one here in my pile, but I don't have another one. And that shit ends up being a uh, M12 by 1.5 straight up I hate the design of their shits because it's supposed to look fancy but they can never stay tight and then um, just whack. This show is pretty wrecked. Clean prep, brand new gasket. Clean prep this bitch. Hit the light brush that I had on top with the soft bristle brush. Cleaned up pretty sickly. Here we go. Them spokes are pretty cool. There's six square pulled up next to me. to come fucking to Jerusalem to get that fucking tie rod in because these putos didn't have it. Fucking finally got this bullshit. Turns out the old caliper bracket had these pressed in. So I had to go and fucking cop these because they wanted that shit for a car charge and I couldn't take the other ones out. But yeah. Comes with a kit with both of them. Just like the bitch and brand new hardware. <coughs> CJ Pony Parts. <coughs> Fuck CJ Pony Parts. This is like fucking eight months late. <laughs> Some shit like that, like four. I had to look at my fucking box of brackets to find this one. I'm gonna have to make some holes and cut it, but it's gonna work. 
for the power steering pump adjustment. A whole ton of fucking bitches. Yeah. Almost cut this one to make it, but out of this thinner one to be sure. Voila! I even had the belt laying around, which is fucking come up when I have to go spend money. And then, bomb. That's an address there, and then, and then kind of gonna keep it nice, clean, and simple, and a little bit of tidy. Yeah, yeah, gotta paint all that shit again. I like to make the edges round after I cut it. Looks more factory. Kind of make it look like this end. So it's all squared up because I cut it with a grinder. Yeehaw, motherfucker. Come on, come on, come on. Can anybody hear me? She nasty. The steering wheel call him apart or some bullshit. <clears throat> Quite eventful. Out. I'm gonna go to the fucking swap me. Fucking came up for the helmet for my nephew. This was gonna like this shit. Just from a piece of this soft rail stock, you can just drill a hole and you make this little tool that they can wrench you so you can release the snap clip on the square body steering column. It's just way easier. I just made it real quick and bam. She out. She out. Doing some fucking street jobs. Since like fucking 5 a.m. Yo, I'm tired already. Always use a C-clamp to retract the caliper to fit to the new brakes. Works good instead of renting that tool or buying it or whatever. I have a bad brake line, I think, here. This brake line. I just don't know where it's broken from. Sick Chevy cover. This is Chevrolet. It goes there, and then this other plate goes over it. It's pretty freaking sick. Needs brakes when you have AC.